Hi, I'm Daniel Cox and welcome to another episode of Photo Tips from the Field. Sponsored by Marsha Lewis and my friends at Bozeman Camera, the small town store big time dealer I like to call them. And today I'm working in the world's first national park, Yellowstone. I've been coming here since I was six or seven years old and working here diligently since the 1980s. This is an amazing place where you have an opportunity to see wild animals in their natural settings and have a chance to photograph them. But today's photo tip is all about using magnification to bring the animals in closer so that you can stay safe and the animals can stay safe. Over the years that I've been working in the park, I've come to understand and appreciate the issues that the Park Service has with people being too close to animals. And that's why I wanted to share with you today new technology that I'm using that really helps me stay back at a great distance to be safe for myself and the creatures that I'm taking pictures of. And that is the new Olympus 150 to 400 millimeter zoom. This is an amazing lens with tremendous magnification. Built for the Micro Four Third system, a system that multiplies every lens you put on it times two. So in this situation, it's a 150 to 400 millimeter lens times two becomes a 300 to 800 millimeter lens. It has a built-in teleconverter of 1.2 times magnification. So when you flip that on, you go from 800 millimeters to 1,000. So it really gives you the ability to stay back from your subject to not only provide safety for you, but also for your subject. And that's a really good thing when working in the national parks. As far as I'm concerned, the most important aspect of wildlife photography is concern for your subjects first. And by using the longer lenses, it really helps you accomplish that. So thanks for joining me here on Natural Exposures TV with another photo tips from the field. If you like what you see, please do me a favor and subscribe below and I'll see you down the road.